my personal perspective as a clinician, as a preventive cardiologist, are that um, these new guidelines certainly give us uh, confirmation of a lot of good things that we've learned over the years, that high potency statins are the best evidence we have for patients and um, that we really do need to use them more um, liberally. I think that the emphasis on behavioral change and lifestyle um, in the new guidelines is extremely important and um, hopefully that will transcend into uh, more effective uh, prevention in terms of behavioral uh, change in patients. However, there are certainly questions about whether risk is being optimized, is being assessed appropriately with the new guidelines, and I think that we still need to take it with a grain of salt and keep in mind personalized medicine and really um, optimizing patient management based on their specific individual risk. So I have looked at the risk calculator and I don't think I'll be using it in, in my patients. Um, unfortunately, it doesn't emphasize um, some important things that go into risk and if anything, it's been shown to overestimate the risk of the patient, in which case it will be leading to more, more statin use. In addition, I think that some of the more important things that we need to um, take into account our family history and um, individual um, risk factors in patients that um, may um, increase our use of the statins. I think that the risk score unfortunately doesn't give us an appropriate assessment. It, uh, it ignores the family history and it also overestimates in many patients um, their level of risk. I do think that it will lead to the more liberal use of statins, which is good because if anything, um, I think there are more patients which would benefit from um, being on statins. I think that there still will be many patients who, just because of age, um, manage to get into the higher risk category but will not actually um, benefit per se from uh, the risk. So. Really, I'd have to see evidence that those patients who have very low risk are going to benefit from being on the statins um, in order for me to change my practice management.